Okay, so what we're doing now, we've got a very simple worm programming running on the real array. Uh, it's a four segment worm, the head is magenta, the three tail segments are blue. Uh, when it hit, uh, hits the wall, if it thinks it's going to try to go through the wall, then it, the head goes white and it pauses for a little bit and then it carries on its journey around the array. And we're just generating random directions and random distances. Um, but that's running on the real array. What I'm going to do now is to come to this same program, exactly the same, but what we're going to do is use the simulation library, so I'm going to upload that. Um, so we're watching it compile down here. Um, uploading. Okay, upload successful. So we're going to open the serial monitor window. Uh, and now we can see the same thing happening on our simulator. The letter M represents magenta. The three B's represent blue, uh, and we're basically it's just like one of those books where the flip books where you drew little figures in the corner and you flip through. And it looks like the figures are animating. We're just drawing this over and over again, uh, and it's sort of you know it's a a poor man's simulator, if you will, of the array. But it does mean that anyone can write a program, uh, run it on this simulator and then send it in and we'll run it on the real array and see what it looks like and video it and post it on the internet. So over to you world.